It's 90 degrees in New York City on Tony night, so I asked the stars how they stay cool on the red carpet, and that's the Tony Pop Poll. <laughs> I don't know, but like when you find out, can you please let me know? I think the breeze is like a little further that way. Gavin Creel has this little fan, and if you stand next to him and you're nice to him, he'll blow it on you. I'm from South Carolina, so I'm like a, I, I, this is right where I live, baby. I love it. I like the heat. There is no secret. I'm sweaty as all get out underneath this dress. I had a banana earlier. You think of an ice cold vodka drink ahead. It's just to relax and enjoy seeing people you like. Staying literally cool, the key is my mommy giving me pats from all my Jewish sweat, who's here with me tonight, truly. And staying uh, emotionally cool is just remembering that this is a once in a lifetime evening and that it's going to pass by no matter what, so I might as well smile and take it in. Not wearing Spanx, unlike me right now, who is sweating profusely from the waist down. Staying hydrated is what I'm learning. I mean, I'm hoping. Having half a dress on top is good. We don't. First of all, we're not like emotionally cool because we have no chill and literally swimming pools in the back and of our just tuxedos. Internalizing. Just the sweat is just right under Yeah, you. We're like a Lynn Nottage play just on the red carpet right now. Just sweat. I'm not wearing any underwear. <laughs> I'm actually like a fried penguin in the suit. There's an ice pack involved. I see some fans. Oh my God, staying cool on the red carpet today, there is no key. I'm sitting here, think cool, think cool, think cool. Well, since I can't have my own personal air conditioner, I would say, uh, you know, just remembering that it's your turn, and last year was somebody else's turn, and somebody, next year will be somebody else's turn. And so just be grateful you have your moment, and then pass the baton.